since two Richmond police officers were shot along Sims Avenue. And now officers Jason Scott and Rashad Martin are talking about their long and very difficult recovery. Karina Bolster has their story. It's a moment these officers have not forgotten. Police say Officer Scott and Martin were called out here to Sems Avenue to investigate an armed party. One of the next things they remember is gunfire. It was definitely a chaotic moment for, for both of us. 60 seconds. That's how long these officers say it took from arriving on scene to getting shot. And go back, watch the videos. Like I didn't even know I ducked behind a tree and came back on the other side. Officer Rashad Martin was shot first in the arm and knee, a bullet shattering his femur. Officer Jason Scott took bullets to his chest and abdomen, injuries that left him fighting for his life. Literally threw me in the back of an explorer and took me down the VC without hesitation. And recovery hasn't been easy. Martin started physical therapy in October and is in need of another surgery. I just didn't think it would take this long to recover from, from a gunshot wound to, to my knee. Meanwhile, Scott is still working to get cleared for PT. He spent more than a month in the hospital after the shooting. But the incredible support these two officers have received is what keeps them going. It really made the, the experience um, not as bad as it, it, it could have been. And both of these officers are certainly aware it could have been much worse. There's so many, so many officers that have been involved in shootings and they don't even get the opportunity ever again to you know, speak to the media because they're no longer here. Despite everything that's happened to both of us, we're still willing to go out here and, and do what we, what we signed up to, for it to do, which is basically protect the community. As for the alleged shooter in this case, 20 year old Wasim Hackett, he faces several charges, including aggravated malicious wounding. A trial date has not yet been set on your side in Richmond. Karina Bolster, NBC 12 News. Thanks.